Mukhtar from Nigeria. Can the charity of a kafir be accepted when he does this on behalf of a Muslim? Well, this has two faults. First of all, a disbeliever, whatever good he does, he's not rewarded for that. And this reward is definitely not coming his way on the day of judgment. So it would not benefit him. He may benefit from it in this life. So his health, his wealth, his food, his drinks, whatever good things happening to him, this is a result from whatever good he did in this life. But when he dies, it's hell for eternity. It's not going to benefit him. Now, the, the, the evidence, وَقَدِمْنَا إِلَى مَا عَمِلُوا مِنْ عَمَلٍ فَجَعَلْنَاهُ هَبَاءً مَنْثُورًا And we, uh, uh, that is Allah Azza wa Jal, would make whatever good they had done into dust. Now, if he does this on behalf of a deceased Muslim, so in this life, people benefited from this endowment. He made a building and the revenue would be given to the poor, so the poor is, are eating, the needy are being, they're getting their uh, stuff fulfilled. All of this is happening. In this case, he, the kafir, would not benefit from it, but the deceased would benefit from it, insha'Allah, azza wa jal. 